Hey guys, this is Halloween Frights here. In today's video, I'm going to be unboxing my Spear Halloween 2022 Nozzles the Clown prop that I got for Easter. And anyway guys, before I start this video, please follow me on YouTube, Halloween Frights. Please like and subscribe to my channel there. Please turn on your post notifications there. Please leave a nice comment down below in the comment section of this video there. And also please share this video with your notifications there. And anyway guys, let's start this unboxing video. So, we're going to be unboxing Nozzles, so... Here is the instruction pamphlet here. Here's the instruction pamphlet of how to set this up. Yes, I know it is in wrap packaging and whatever. So let me get this out of here and we'll start setting nozzles to clown up. So I got this for Easter or late Easter or whatever. Here's the instruction pamphlet here. Not very hard to set up except the clothes, which is a very hard thing to do. And also some, I guess there's also a thing of where you set up fog attachments. So here are the instructions here on how to set them. This is how, this is, here's the whole entire instructions here on how to set them up. I guess here's the back here. For, I think this is for unboxing it and prop remote stuff. And this is also a little setup here of where you can set up step pads, trimy buttons, and fog um, fog machine stuff. So, Arlo, let's start pulling out the pieces and then my dad's going to assist me here whenever we need this fixed or wherever, wherever I'm stuck. So, you guys, let's start this. So first, let's get out all of our things we need. Put this in here so you guys can see this. First, all right, first, we got foam pieces for him here. Next, we got his shoes, his orange shoes. His orange shoes here. Okay. Next, we got more of these little foam holes here. I guess it's probably just trash. I don't know. Anyway, oh, here's another. I think this is his arm here. Oopsie. Okay, so here's a tube here of where you can um, put fog, connect to it to a fog machine and put it through his hand and fog will come out of his hand. So here's, I guess, here's one of his arms here. Let's see here. We got, here's another hand here. This is probably, I, this wire here, I believe is for his movement with the hand or Connects to the fog thing. Here's another fog too where he connected to his hands and a fog machine here. So here's this little arm here. Here is his, let's see. Oh, all right, so here is the mechanism for him of where he moves. This is his mechanism of, where, of how he moves and stuff. Here is his clothes here. Here's his neck ruffles, his pants, and his shirt here. Very nice clothes. Definitely very awesome for nozzles. Here is his adapter here. As you can see, there's his adapter here. We'll get that out right now. Very nice adapter. Here is uh, here is more fog attachment, or this here is some attachment to attach his hands to fog or whatever fog attachment stuff here. We're not going to be doing fog here because we're going to be because we're setting up him up inside and not um, outside today. Because as you may know, it's not Halloween when I'm doing this. It's actually April. 
sometime in April when I'm doing this, but we will definitely put fog on him outside on him when, when he is outside for Halloween. So yeah, but for right now, no fog for a while. But anyway, okay, so let's see here. Here is his hand. This is where, or here, I'm sorry. Here is his nozzles hand here where you put this on his hand and it lights up and fog comes out of it. Very cool hand. Love why they call him Nozzles the Clown because of this hand right here, because of that. Here it is, let's see, so, all right, so here is his head here. Very, I very like this head. This head reminds me of one of the nozzles that I saw at Spirit, like in store. Looks like a Rosal, Georgia's second location or review for Nozzles head here. Very, here, let's unwrap it and I will show you it on camera. Okay, here is his head out of the package. Very cool head. Oh, jeez. Okay, here's his head here out of the package. Very cool head, guys. I love this head. This is where, this is the water here where his eyes light up. Love this head, definitely. Put this down. So, hold on, I'll do this. Okay. All right, anyway, let's see here. Hold on really quick. Let me tell you this. All right, so let me go grab some scissors really quick, guys, and then I will be back in a minute to get the base and to tie the thing out. So sorry if you're seeing nothing really, whatever. Okay. All right, so I'm back with scissors now. I guess I should have done that before I filmed, but it's okay, though. Here's... So this is my first... Well... It's my first unboxing video on my new YouTube channel, so please enjoy this, guys. Anyway, here's the poles for his legs here. Here is uh, another hand for where it lights up here. Here is, let's see, another pole here. Let's see here. Here is where, hold on, okay. Here is his control box here and another mechanism where it moves here. And in the final, and then finally here is nozzles as base. So we're gonna, and here it is here. Okay, so that wraps up the boxing portion. I'm sorry, the unboxing portion of Nozzles the Clown. I hope you enjoyed that. Oops, sorry. So now we're going to get... So now we're going to be doing the second part of filming this. Is actually... is and Now the second part we're going to be doing is setting Nozzles the Clown up. So we enjoyed the boxing, guys, and we will set them up right now. So first here we have... The base lined up, as you can see. Sorry if it's super blurry right now. Let me see. Okay, so sorry if it's okay. So, firstly, here we have the shoes. Okay, so firstly, we're going to be putting the C pole. Or whatever he's looking for. There's all those head guys. Okay, there we go. So I feel super blurry. Okay. Okay, so first off, my dad is putting pole B on this side here. Okay, so we put pole B in there. Our next one here we have is pole. This is our next pole here. We have here is pole B. And now he's putting pole B on this side here. Okay. 
All right, so next, I'm gonna be putting this shoe here on him. So it's gonna go right here. So there, are his shoes. there are his shoes here. Next, we're gonna be putting pole C onto this one here. Next, we're gonna be putting foam H on this leg and then this leg here. So here is pull H here. I'm gonna be putting it like this. Sorry, maybe it's wrong. Maybe I did it wrong. Hold on. Let me think of how you would do this here. Okay, so my dad's gonna do it for me. Thank you very much to him. Okay, so we got two poles now. These two poles, or the, I'm sorry, the foam on the two legs here. Next, now my dad is going to be putting on the pants for Nozzles the Clown here. I really like this head, actually. It's so cool. So he's going to be downstairs here until about, I think, next sometime next week. And then after, I think, before Thursday next week, he will be going upstairs in my room or wherever I'm going to put him. But for right now, he's going to be sitting down here, over here, where his box is, or Nozzle the Clown's box is. All right, so, so now we have the pants on for Nozzle's. All right, now my dad is going to be putting this part, the, the control box thing or whatever it is for nozzles. He's going to be putting that on right now. I love this guy, guys. He is very cool. Now he is now he is putting the pants up on nozzles, covering this thing here. All right, now my dad is putting the control box on nozzles the clown here, on top of this thing here. So these I think are for his hands, and then. Or head. I think this one's for his head probably. I don't know. Here's his motion sensor here. His nozzles is... He's actually almost to the ceiling up here, guys. It's... I don't know if it's going to be that tall to be in touch of the ceiling, but it's literally kind of almost touching this lowest part of the ceiling here. Hey, Terry. Now my dad is connecting the wires here. For nozzles, the clown, this is probably either his head or the motion sensor thing. Now my dad is putting the shirt on for nozzles, the clown. Since I'm not really the best at um, doing the clothes, so I have an assistant here who does it for me, so... Very thank you for, to him. All right, so now my dad is putting the motion sensor on the shirt for Nozzle the Clown here. He's fixing it up, make sure it looks good. All right, now my dad is going to be putting on the, the, the um, arms for nozzles where you can connect a fog machine to him. And this is what he looks like right now, halfway set up. Got the shoes on, got the foam in there, got the motion sensor. You got this thing under there. They got the poles and you got the shirt on and then you got this part for his head. And then now we're on this part where you have to put in the arms for nozzles. And then I will also be doing a demo on nozzles whenever he is done, so. 
So this is called, so this is might be called either Spear Halloween 2022 or Spear Halloween Nozzles the Clown unboxing slash setup and demo for nozzles here. So right now my dad is putting on the arm for nozzles where you can connect up, where you can connect fog to him. Very nice. Love the outfit. This is so cool. Look at this outfit here. So this is going to go on YouTube. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. So he's about six feet tall. So not as big as the towering clown, but he's probably... And, like, whenever the towering clown is, like, big, like, all set up right and stuff, he would look really big compared to this one. But, you know, this guy's still a good clown. He was, it was awesome. It was also awesome seeing him in stores. I just love his phrases, too, of nozzles. You shall see a demo and a ghostly review on him pretty soon. All right, so I'm going to bring his pants down. There we go. So right now my dad has connected one of the arms for nozzles where he can put fog on him. Now my dad is connecting the other arm to the thing here for nozzles the clown where he can also put fog on him and he does his thing. Again, sorry if the quality was poor at first. Like this is a def like this phone is not like old. This is a brand new phone. This is the iPhone 13. This is a definitely a very new phone, so yeah. Here's what the back looks like of him here. Got all the poles and stuff here. I just love his head here. Like, his head is so good. Like, I love his head here. See, it reminds me of one of the nozzles from, like, Buford or Walswell or something. Just, like, the, the, the shape of him. All right. Now my dad is going to be putting on nozzles his hands, which is which are nozzles that are connected. And if you... Connect that little wire here. This is what it looks like. This this will light up right here. So he is a very cool clown. F goes in here. Oh, I don't want to know. Here's some, okay. Here's nozzles here almost set up here. All right, now my dad is putting on the other hand for nozzles here. Which you can also connect Fox to his other hand too, which we'll be doing that another time when Halloween is around. So if you enjoy that, guys. Oh yeah, we oh, almost forgot to mention my dad also plugged his adapter in here to his thing here. Okay. Now my dad has, well, my dad is fixing the arm right now because I think he messed up on it by accident, which is okay though. Because he is almost done though. Cause he's, so the last, I think, things here for nozzles are his adapter, this fog thing, which will not be, this, this fog thing, so that will, that will not be in the setup. So this will be, I mean, I'll do a video on how to set up the fog for nozzles in a different video for this guy, for maybe when it's Halloween. And then I guess we're also our final part here is putting nozzles as ruffles on, neck ruffles on. I'm gonna do that. Okay, and then our next step, my dad is putting the head on for nozzles here. 
Very nice head. I love it. Here you're going to see him put on the head for nozzles here. The best way I can. Here, I'll show you from the back here. See his head's going to be on here in a minute. Trying to get you the best view so you guys can see this here. All right, here's his head. Oh, no. Okay. All right, so here is Nozzles' head here. He's putting Nozzles' head on right now. Oh. You need help? Okay, anyway. All right, so my dad is putting on Nozzles' head right now. So that's almost in there, and he plugged in the wire for his head so his eyes can light up yellow, which is very nice. Here. Here's an Ozzles here from, show you from a point of view here. This is him from the side here. Very nice. He is actually very big. I expect that. He always about to spray me with some poisonous gas, but oh well though. All right, so he will. So he is our new clown for Halloween this year. He will be out in our circus. I like to call it evil clown circus. He will be in there for this year. He's gonna go in there for Halloween this year. So yep, there's nozzles. Very nice clown. So yeah, I also heard that people say like he is kind of like, he's still a good prop, but like he's kind of the worst material because I've seen him in stores like where he's broken, like some stores where he is unfortunately broken or like damaged by people. So he would not really be the, he is still a very good prop, I gotta say, but like the quality would not be very good because he can always kind of break sometimes. But at other stores though, I've seen him very working good, like Roswell, I've seen him working good, Buford. Um, let's see, Dunwoody, I've seen him working good, even though his sound was turned down. Brookhaven, second location, good. First Brookhaven, not really. Uh, Anderson, South Carolina was good for nozzles. Cool. Greenville was okay, except his hands were kind of like a little off, but still good working though. And Rowan, Georgia, too. So, so, so Nozzles has kind of actually survived in most locations during the season. So, shout out to him for surviving in most locations. So, good for good for you, Nozzles. All right. And so, we are pretty much done with the Nozzle setup. My dad just put, um, my dad just, um, put on Nozzles' neck ruffles. And then now, with the final step my dad's doing is putting his adapter into his control box. And then we will put them somewhere over here, and I will turn them on, and I will show you a demo, guys. So I hope you enjoy this. So here's the control box here, somewhere, if you can see. I'm trying to give you a good view. So I'm going to let my dad do his thing first, and then I will show you. Sorry, this is a long video, but I hope you guys enjoy nozzles. And then also... Here is his box here, guys. This is what his box came in. So, there's his box here. And here is him all set up. So, yes. Here's his hands. He's gonna... My dad's just doing the final thing. Just putting his adapter in. And I'll fix him up a little bit. And then we will turn him on. In a minute. First, I'm going to arrange some of this. All right, so that must be a fog adapter, I'm thinking. The one down there, unless it's an adapter for this thing. All right, I'll do it, buddy. Okay. Okay, so we are officially done with the nozzle the clown setup. Let me fix them up really quick, and then we will turn them on.
if I can find his little thing. So hold on, guys. Hold on a minute. Thing. All right. So where is his thing? Where? How do you turn this guy on? I'm trying to trying to see where you turn him on. Is there buttons or something here? Hold on. I got to feel for buttons. Okay. They're in the back. So let me. Okay. Here they are. So here are nozzles, buttons here. Okay. We'll put them on the sensor. All right, so he's gonna be very loud. So I don't know how loud he's gonna be. So I hope you guys enjoy this. All right, so we're gonna turn on Nozzle the Clown right now, and I hope you guys enjoy the demo. I will show you one demo on Nozzles here. If I can find an adapter reach here. Hold on, guys, for a minute. I want to give you the best. Okay, so uh oh. Okay, all right, here's Nozzles the Clown, guys. Nothing like a little Halloween box to set the Very mood. nice. I can't get enough of this stuff. Get a load of this holiday <laughs> Okay. All right, so anyway, guys, this wraps up my Nozzles the Clown demo here. If you guys enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up. Please like and subscribe to my channel here. Please turn on your post notifications there. Please leave a nice comment down below in the comment section of this video there. And also, please share this video with your friends there. Anyway, guys, this is Halloween Fright Sign Out. I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.